So I got the engine in. That was fun. My little tractor was able to lift it okay. 615 pounds with the crate, which most of which I've removed already. It's a Coyote uh, five liter, 460 horse, fuel injected. Should be plenty for this little car. Now I'm trying to gather up all the parts. Um, I've got the bell housing bolts there in the little white box and then uh, the drive shaft you can see right there and there's a bunch of other parts needed bell housing is in that is right here and bell housing bolts uh, in that white box like i said i've got the throw out bearing i've not yet ordered the flywheel and the clutch. There is a flywheel on the engine, but they say it won't work. I don't know why that is, but uh, they say just remove that and toss it. So they've been right about everything else. So I'm sure that's what we need to do. Working on the rear hubs, I got the old uh, lug bolts out, pounded those out, got them removed, and got to put the new ones in uh, so that they'll match, match with the front. And then there's a big chunk of aluminum you have to cut off of these rear spindles. And so here's the rear spindle. And the piece you got to cut off is basically right across here. Got a cutoff wheel I'm hoping to do that with. And then uh, I'll smooth it down a little bit with the belt sander. So, but the front's looking pretty good. Brakes are all installed. Really the front suspension is done. I've ordered the tires, I'm waiting on those. And when they come in, I'll get those mounted on the wheels, which already have the wheels. And then I'll do a test fit on the front. Now on the back, I don't know how far I'll get because the, the half shafts go from here, from the differential out to the, to the wheel hub. Those are on back order from factory five, so don't have those yet. But be sure and admire this Coyote crepe motor. That's something. Okay, I also got the oil pan takes a special oil pan. There's an oil pan that comes on the engine, but it won't fit. And so you have to get this uh, aftermarket Rosso pan. Uh, it's a pretty, pretty substantial uh, solid aluminum looking unit. I'll show it more later, but that should be a pretty good update for now. Today is, uh, what day is it? The 24th of August. 2022. Still got lots of boxes of parts, as you can see. And some more parts over there in the cabinet. And uh, there's the car. Looking good. I did also get the EC, the uh, ECM, the computer control for the, for the Coyote engine. That's here. Nice and bubble wrapped, as well as the wiring harness that goes with it and uh, the air box and a few other kind of related components. So that's the update.